If I tell you that a war is the shortest in history, that would imply that we know how long it lasted. Yet, there is no general consensus. The most commonly cited numbers are 38 and 45 minutes. So I'll have to give you some context. In 1896, Khalid bin Bargash took over the throne of Zanzibar without the consent of the UK. The British, who had just lost a lot of influence over that country now, sent this guy an ultimatum to leave the palace and lower his flag. The ultimatum would expire at 9am on the 27th of August, by which point the British would open fire. At 8.55am, five minutes before the ultimatum expired, the British ships were ordered to prepare for battle. Many argue that the war started now because they were ordered to prepare for battle, but the ultimatum hadn't expired yet, and they weren't actually ordered to shoot. Five minutes later, the ultimatum expired, and the British ships were ordered to open fire. However, they did not start firing until 9.02am. So these are the three proposed times for the start of the war. 8.55, when they were ordered to prepare for battle. 9am, when they were ordered to battle. And 9.02, when they actually battled. But we also disagree about the end time of the war. According to most sources, the last shots were fired at 9.37am, and some sources say 9.45am. However, the ship's logs all disagree about when the war ended. The flagship's records say 9.35 a.m., others say 9.40, 9.41, and 9.45 a.m. respectively. But while the length of the shortest war in history is a disputable topic, so is the longest war in history. If you watch this video over here, you'll learn all about that now.